Beloved leader and supervisor, may I encourage you today. I will tell you, friend, that there are two kinds of faith, and the Lord wants you to have both, both the, a, a complete faith. The first one is the faith to, man, to do maintenance, to uh, defend, to consolidate, to establish what the Lord already gave you. And sometimes it's the faith for tolerance, it's the faith for endurance, it's the faith to suffer even unto death. It's when you don't give up because you have tremendous faith in God and you know that what you're doing is His will. But then there is another aspect of faith, which is faith for conquering, faith for the conquest, faith to take back territory that the devil stole from us. And ministries cannot, only, cannot grow well in one kind of faith only. Some of you might be only on the defensive. And then you don't know how to advance, to multiply, to plant new groups, to increase the ministry that the Lord has given you, to double everything the Lord gave you. That's the faith of conquest. So one faith is for consolidation or for endurance, and the other faith is to take back the territory that the devil stole to our cultures and to our lives. So I want to encourage to be a man, a woman of complete faith. And that's a secret for your ministry to multiply. Amen? Okay, before I go, I want to also bring a word in regard to uh, the, the celebration of Halloween. I have seen many Christians, they just celebrate it with, together with the worldly people. Now, if you're going to celebrate Halloween, there's nothing really to celebrate there. But if you're going to celebrate, first of all, for, it's Reformation Day. Celebrate Martin Luther and what God has done through him and Calvin and Swingley and others. But also, if you want to be part of the culture, use discernment so that you don't transmit a confusing message. Allow me, please, allow me this exhortation. Because God will not... For, we will not uh, pass over ignorance, willful ignorance or lack of discernment. So a mother and a father that dress their little daughter like a witch, that's not, that's not a good message. That's no clarity. And you know that at, uh, Halloween is an occultic uh, celebration. So if you're going to be part of it, be part of it with a message, the clarity of the gospel. Be part of it to bring people to Christ. Amen. I hope you can receive this. I share it with you in love because God will not bypass ignorance. Willful ignorance is, is, is a sin and the Bible condemns it. So we need to know, we need to have that discernment of spirits and know what we are doing in every situation. I love you. Keep strong. We are all imperfect, but we serve a perfect God who loves us all. God bless you.